What's up everybody? Welcome back to day seven in our Christmas week look at holiday themed beers. So today we have one from Westbrook Brewing Company and they are out of Mount Pleasant, South Carolina. This is the night before. It being Christmas Eve, I figured that this one would probably be kind of appropriate to do. Dig that can art. Got that kind of Nightmare Before Christmas vibe going for it. Uh, they say that this is a gingerbread stout, um, an imperial stout with natural flavors. Um, and that's all it says. Uh, clocking in at 11% ABV. This guy was canned on 10-17-23, so two months in the can at the time of review. Um, big fan of um, Westbrook. They make really good stouts. I'm a big fan of their um, Mexican cake. Um, I had the opportunity to have this um, on Black Friday. One of my local bottle shops actually tapped a keg of this, but I didn't get any of it because I knew that I would probably be cracking into this one during this week. And um, so I wanted to go in blind. Um, plus, I was drinking a lot of bourbon counties that they had tapped also. So that's that. Um, so, yeah, never had this beer. Excited to try it. Scrack open. Ooh, pretty dark out of there. Yeah, that's pitch black. Little touch over a finger ahead. Mocha. Mocha head. I mean, that's just like a fluffy head going on on this guy. Coats that glass really, really well. That is just a fluffy boy. Yeah, pitch black. Not getting anything through this thing. And that head for 11% is sticking around pretty good. Let's get a nose in her. Ooh, definitely picking up those ginger spices. Those gingerbread spices. Lots of ginger in this. Yeah, loads and loads of just ginger. Um, I do pick up a little slight chocolate in this as well. Maybe a touch of cinnamon, but just, I mean, huge, huge ginger. Just jumping off of this beer. Diving in. Cheers. Yeah, loads of ginger. I mean, just straight up front. This ginger just pops you right in the face. I have some people working on the house, so I hear the knocking. That's what that is. But yeah, this thing is just, just a ginger. I mean, loads of ginger. And it just lasts throughout the entire thing. Pops you right up front. Ginger throughout. There is a nice little kind of roastiness to it. It's kind of like a burnt roast thing going on. And you pick that up round about mid palate. This thing's not overly sweet, which I kind of dig. It does have a, a slight, just kind of malty sweetness to it. But it's not like an overly sweet um, beer. Man, that ginger is just... They put a lot of ginger in this guy. And it's not a bad thing. I'm calling it a gingerbread stout. I want to pick up on that. There is a little bit of like some just generic kind of like baking spices going on. in this as well can't really discern any one in particular but there is like a kind of a clovey kind of um, cinnamon thing kind of going on the body on this is I would say very high medium to full 
and it's kind of got that oily stickiness thing going for it as well but yeah the thing about this beer is all about that ginger yeah and nothing just lingers that kind of gingerness just kind of pops you up front and continues throughout and then even in the finish I mean it just lingers that ginger that ginger spice just kind of like lingers in the back of your in the back of your mouth I kind of like this beer it's definitely um probably the most ginger forward beer um, that I've had um, this week because we've done a lot of beers with like ginger in them um, and I mean maybe even overall the most ginger I've had in a beer in a really really long time this guy's pretty decent um, at 11% you don't really pick up uh, the alcohol until until it's kind of going down you do get a little bit of that warming but um in the sip it's not distracting there's no al alcohol burn um, on the taste to it And I do like kind of that burnt kind of roast that kind of comes in about mid palate. It kind of helps distract a little bit from just overpowering like ginger flavor that this thing is. And if that wasn't there, I would say that this thing um, was a no go. But the fact that that kind of that burnt kind of roast is there really helps this beer out a lot. Yeah, I dig it. Five ninety nine a can. I'd probably pick it up again. Um, I don't think I could have more than like one of these um, in a sitting, just because that. I mean, it's just like overwhelmingly ginger. Um, in fact, I think about you know if this thing was a, probably like a twelve ouncer, it would probably be a little bit better. Um, I just don't think that 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 you don't need that much of it. Um, but I'm gonna go enjoy the rest of it. I'm gonna finish this thing off for sure. It's a it's a good beer. Um, loads of ginger. If you're into that ginger thing, you're gonna be into this. I like it. I'm gonna go finish the rest of it. Hope you have a Merry Christmas Eve. Hope all your shopping's done. And you're ready for tomorrow. Um, we will be doing one more tomorrow. We will have a Christmas Day uh, review. So hope to see you then. Cheers.